Hello and welcome to our video series on the integration of digital material in teaching. In this video, we'll be focusing on Canva and all its useful and interesting features. Canva is an online design software. It can create high quality graphic designs, including posters, documents, presentations, and social media posts. You can sign up for free with your email address by clicking on sign up. It has a paid plan also. But if you are an active educator, you can access tons of features of the pro version for free by getting verified. Let's log in together and see how can we do that. Once you signed up for the first time, you're going to see this page. You have to choose why you are going to use Canva. I'm going to use it as a teacher. Choose your student's level and continue. Click on Get Started. You have to fill in your personal information and also the name and the address of your school. Once you enter all of the information, click on Continue. Now, you have to upload a document that shows your teaching qualification or employment status. After uploading your file, the Submit button will be activated and you have to click on Submit. Once you submit it, the response will be sent in seven days. Now, let's dive into the website. On the left side toolbar, there is a home button to reach the home page. You can create docs, whiteboards, presentations, social media posts, videos, websites, and more by clicking this three dots icon. Choose the type of project you want to create from scratch. We're going to see how to create a project and edit it from a template later together. On projects, you can see the projects you have made before. On templates, you can find tons of templates on various subjects. We're going to come back to this part later. If you have a brand, you can use the Brand Hub to create customized material for your brand. On apps, you can access different apps and get documents, photos, and so on from your accounts on those apps. On Create Team, you can create a team by entering the email addresses of people you want to add, and you can work together on Canva with your team. On Trash, you can find your deleted files and restore them in 30 days. Let's see how can we create material and edit a template. Click on Templates, choose the topic and choose what you want to create. Let's create storyboards. When you click on a template, a pop-up menu opens that you can check whether it fits what you want to create. If you want to use it, click on Customize this template. On the left side toolbar, the design is where you can change the template and style, color combinations and the font of the text. On Elements, you can add so many things like line and shapes, graphics, stickers, photos, videos, audio, and so on from the library of Canva. Also, you can search the element you want to add from search bar. You can add a text by adding a text box or ready to use text by searching on it or scrolling down and choosing what you like. On uploads, you can upload images, videos, audio, from your computer or your social media and cloud accounts. On Draw, you can create something by drawing it. On Projects, you can insert the project you have created before. On Apps, there are more to add to your design. You can add charts, photos, audio, videos. You can set the background. And also, you can add translation what you have done on the design in any language you want. Click on Translate. Choose the language you want to translate into. Choose the page you want to translate and click on translate. And the translated version edit as a new page. How cool is that? Let's go back apps. There are more to talk about. Let's scroll down. Now, as you can see, there are apps here. You can access your accounts on various apps and add something from your account. On the left side of the design page, you can animate your design. Choose an animation you want to add. And on positions, you can set the positions of layers like images and text. All the things you have done with your design are automatically saved. When your creation is ready, you can share it by clicking the share button on the top right side of the screen. You can copy the link, present it, present and record it. Also, you can download your design by clicking here in different file types. 
They seem pro version plans, but once you get verified as a teacher, you will be able to use them. Now you know how to use Canva. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any questions or feedback, please feel free to leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe for more video education content.